So Shelburne Museum is a museum that is really unlike any other. Uh, we're located on 45 acres um, of rolling green fields. We have 39 buildings and structures that range from a steamboat called the Ticonderoga to a lighthouse that used to be on the Colchester Reef um, to schoolhouses and meeting houses that have been pulled from all over New England. Um, these buildings were all set up to house museum founder Electra Habemeyer Webb's extraordinary collection. There's something that everybody can relate to. You see the most expensive and you see something that a farmer would have had in his own house. It's just a visual extravaganza. It's been called a collection of collections and I think that really sums it up so beautifully. Were any of these buildings here when we started? None of them were here. They brought them all here. It's amazing for somebody to care that much about it to say, I want to preserve that moment in time. One of the things that make this museum unique is that it really marries up the contemporary with the traditional. Shelburne Museum was founded in 1947 by Electra Havemeyer Webb, who was a pioneering collector of American folk art. The daughter of H.O. and Lewisine Havemeyer, important collectors of European and Asian art, Mrs. Webb chose a different path and sought out art, artifacts, and architecture celebrating a distinctly American aesthetic. Electra Havemeyer Webb knew that when she was collecting so many of these things way back and had the goal always that she wanted to share them with everybody else. in Shelburne, Vermont, and today is Haunted Happening. The museum is a playground for children and adults of all ages to come and enjoy.